In the 1960s, scientists at Bell Laboratories actually built a working jetpack, and it could really fly for 20 seconds. It was called the Bell Rocket Belt, a hydrogen peroxide-powered pack that turned liquid fuel into superheated steam jets. With one pull of the lever, it shot out 130 kilograms of thrust, enough to lift a man off the ground like a human rocket. For a few glorious seconds, he hovered, free from gravity. The world gasped. The future was here. But here's the problem. It could only fly for 21 seconds, and a single mistake meant instant disaster. The U.S. Army tested it, but decided it was too short, too heavy, and far too dangerous. Jetpack soldiers would never happen. By the 1970s, the dream faded. The rocket belt became a museum relic, proof that human flight was possible, but not practical. 20 seconds of flight, a lifetime of imagination. Bell's jetpack didn't conquer the sky, but it proved we'd never stop trying.